Hello YouTube, this is Solo Chinchilla with another StarCraft Road to Got to Diamond <laughs> Road to Diamond Road to Diamond game. We're just gonna put this to times two speed because nobody likes the beginning of a game. It's all boring. There's nothing to talk about. So as you can see, this is a nine minute and twenty nine second game. It is a Protoss versus Protoss. Protoss, as I might have said, I don't really remember. So I am in the bottom left corner with Ivan in the top right corner. Perhaps he's Russian. So this is just very standard play out of both of us. Our pylons went down at very similar timing. <clears throat> so my gateway a little behind his, but I am going to get my gas earlier, I believe. Uh, never mind. <laughs> just a yeah, his gas is going to complete a while before mine. But I am going to go for an early scout here because on this map especially, I like to go for a contain. I like to put down a proxy pylon right here. Alright, so I just set up a whole bunch of waypoints. He's taking a whole bunch of probes off the line to attack my one probe. I'm not sure why he did this, but I do notice it. And I'm going to take off these waypoints in one second here. And I'm just going to try to go in his probe line because now that I know that he's going to take all these probes off to attack my one probe, I'm just going to take advantage of that and keep going in his probe line and force him to attack me. <clears throat> so, for some reason he only has one work... Oh, he took his probe off gas to attack my, <laughs> my probe. Uh, yeah, micro skills, what can I say? <laughs> uh, his cybernetic core, cybernetics core is a while before mine. But, uh... One pylon. Alright, well, my probe is still alive <laughs> out of all the times that he's taken his all his probes off to attack mine it's still gonna live up oh, nope and there it goes it's dead but so I am going for an early contain so I'm gonna be trying to get out as many zealots and stalkers out early as I possibly can and I'm gonna be going for that warp gate since I am gonna try to set up a contain I'm sending my first zealot over there for early pressure really but the early pressure does tur turn into a contain and then turn into I don't want to say a four gate because it was too too late for a four gate, but it is it would be like a four gate, but just later in the game since it is nine minutes and twenty nine seconds. So I'm gonna get up the rest of my gateways here, my second gas. His he's getting a robotics right now, I think. Oh no, wait, who's getting a robotics here? He's getting a robotics. Um, uh, he for immortals. Yeah, that's right. He's getting it for immortals. So my zealot is here. I'm not sure when I'm going to send a probe over to, to make a proxy pylon because my warp gate, well, it's halfway done, you know. But right now there isn't really much going on. As you can see, I have a, here, let's look at units here. Um, units are the same except I have a lot, a lot, a lot more probes than he does. So obviously my, my, economy, my economy is, my economy is going to be way better than his. So I am just poking up this ramp to see what he has, and I do see that we have the same exact units that Zell is just taking a bit of damage. I thought he was going to chase me right here, but he actually isn't. So his second Zealot is out earlier before mine, but I do have a second Stalker, and he only has one. So obviously a Stalker is better than a uh, Zealot. It costs gas and 25 more minerals. So I am sending out my probe here to make a proxy pylon right here. This Stalker already on the way. So... Okay, at this point, I, I'm pretty sure I'm just making stalkers. And, okay, he, he's making an observer. Let's see where this is rallied to. Okay, no rally. Uh, let's see if he does anything with this, because really, at this point, there's nothing he can do, because I already have a lot more stuff than he does. He has two zealots and one stalker, and I have six stalkers and one zealot. So, I am going to poke up this ramp, and he does see this contain that I've set up. Oh wait, no, this is this is these are his units. So these stalkers are just on the way, these four. And once I get this proxy pylon set up right here, there is there's gonna be a lot more unit production for me because I'm gonna be right next to his base of course. So at this point I probably should have expanded but yeah never mind. I would just stay I'm saving up minerals so I can make those uh the, the stalkers. So I'm I have way more production than he does. He really can't do anything because his mothership core is just getting out. So if he knew that he wasn't gonna be make that is that is an okay force wield. 
out of him. But if he knew that he was going for the early immortal, um, he should have gotten his mothership core out a lot earlier. Because now that he just got it out, it doesn't have enough energy for a photon overcharge. So if he would have gotten it early, he wouldn't have enough energy for that. And he might have been able to hold this off possibly, or at least delay it for a while. Because I would have had to back out if he had uh, used photon overcharge on the Nexus. But as you can see, the mothership core is going down at this point. There's really nothing he can do because I'm just warping in stalkers over and over again. Um, I'm not sure what he's doing. He's not microing his probes at all. He's not trying to make another base. He's just kind of sitting on it. You know, and there's no GG out of him yet, but I have 10 stalkers and he has a an observer. One observer. <laughs> but like I said, I am in Bronze League and this is Rotes Diamond. So, there's the GG. Um, I think I pulled this off, this game off very well, actually. Compared to the last game that I uploaded on Rose of Diamond. Because I had all of my warp gates set up. The only thing that I didn't do that well was my timing for my cybernetics core. His cybernetics was out a lot earlier than mine. But other than that, I got my proxy piling out at a good time. You know, it could have been a little earlier. But in all the units, like, I, uh, I stockpiled minerals and gas right before I got that pile on. So I could warp in a, a lot of stalkers. And as you can see, it paid off. But... What he could have done better is he could have made a lot of probes and gotten his mothership core out earlier because he knew he was going for that early immortal. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, like, favorite, subscribe because that's how I know if you're enjoying this series. So if, if, uh, if there's not a lot of likes, then I'll quit. But if there is a lot of likes, then I know you guys are liking it. So, um, alright, have a good day.